So, on that note. Oh my god, let's play Baldur's Gate. Is the card still out? No, I think we're fine. Okay. Uh, anyway, it's so unfortunate when younger cats mess with older cats. I hate it. All right, let's check real quick. Yeah, there we go. Okay, awesome. Mm. All right. You fights with monsters should look. Oh. Wait a second. I don't think this will work. Oh, I have to put the. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Anymore. Oh wow! Look at all these. Be an elf. Be a fighter. Do I want to be a wizard slayer, maybe? No? Okay. Just a normal fighter? Let's be a ranger. An archer. Archers really fall off in BG2? Yeah. I think if we switch to... Uh, Madrakar was telling me if we switch to uh, Crossbow in BG2, it's okay. Uh -oh. Hey! Holiday pizza for the mods. Keep up the good work. Obo with the $100 tip to the mod team. Also, Lore Ren uh, Enger says, Happy holidays, co-mods and chat. Been lurking for a while, and I love the stream and vibes here. Random question, is there any plan to get your intro songs? I want to add them to my running list. Um, at some point, we do have custom music for our intro. And at some point, we want to get them um, out there. But we're not sure how yet. We're still working on that. But thank you. Um, Zaylin, 15 months. It's RPG time at its finest. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. 
Um, I think I think we're gonna do fighter. I don't want to do fighter. Maybe a fighter fighter. Is that way we could kind of like play around with it and maybe do some um, melee stuff if we want to later. Do a multi class. What's Kensai? Uh, Kensai is a sword saint. Funny enough, you can make it apparently an awesome throwing weapon build with Kensai. Yep. Fighter, mage, thief, class, Tonzo combo. Ease. Why did you not immediately pick it when you read Sword Saint? All right. We'll probably make, we'll probably make a new character for two, I'm guessing. Maybe. That is so torn right now. It is. Oh, we'll do neutral good. I don't need strength that high. We're gonna be doing it's gonna be a range run, so we're gonna be we're gonna need high decks. I'm scubbing the absolute heck out of these rolls. I want 85 or higher. Yep. Ah! It was an 87. Those are so rare. I clicked too fast, chat. Too fast, too furious. Store it? I should have. Wait, isn't that really good? You do that. Strength Archer build? Yeah, buddy. Why do I need charisma? You don't? Okay. Like that. Oh, for dialogues? To seduce women? Oh, well, I mean, that's important. Okay, I want a uh, long, long bow. We'll do long sword. Because I think I get plus one in both of those. We're gonna get a lot more later too, so. them a right thrashing get over here let's give them a right thrashing let's give them a right thrashing yes stupendous right. i'll do normal nestled atop the cliffs that rise from the sword coast the Citadel of Candlekeep houses the finest and most comprehensive collection of writings on the face of Farron. It is an imposing fortress kept in strict isolation from the intrigues that occasionally plague the rest of the Forgotten Realms. It is secluded, highly regimented, and it is home. Within these hallowed halls of knowledge, your story begins. You have spent most of your 20 years of life within this keep's austere walls under the tutelage of the sage Gorion. Acting as your father, he has raised you on a thousand tales of heroes and monsters, lovers and infidels, battles and tragedies. However, one story was always left untold, that of your true heritage. 
You have been told that you are an orphan, but your past is largely unknown. Lately, Gorion has been growing distant from you, as if some grave matter weighs heavily on his heart. You have asked about his concerns as gently as possible, but your queries have been in vain. Your sole comfort is the knowledge that he is a wise man, and you know he will tell you when the time is right. Nonetheless, his silence is troubling, and you cannot help but feel that something is terribly wrong. Today, Gorion has appeared more agitated than ever, and now he has uncharacteristically interrupted your chores in the middle of the day. Imparting hurried instructions for you to equip yourself for travel, he has handed you what gold he can spare, but given no clue as to why. Nevertheless, you now stand before the Candle Keep Inn, ready to purchase what you need for an unplanned and unexpected journey. Does Ko remember the story? Not at Michelle. all. Nope. Uh, thank you, yo, with a 10 bomb. Appreciate it. Brian, my foster father, has informed me. Okay. You have but to ask. Hey, tutor. Hello, child. Uh, I know about all this. Your lessons? Where's my journal? Oh, quick save. Nice. Okay. Uh, pre scroll. Important events. Find Gorion. Brian, my foster father has informed me that we must immediately leave the candle keep and set on a journey. He's given me some gold and I have to purchase supplies for the road, including weapons and armor. Okay. Uh oh. It shall be as you wish. Hello, child. Uh, tell me how to sell things. Tell me to listen to rumors. Yourself? If you want to listen to people talk, you need to drink with them. Choose the beverage of choice from the list. Select buy and listen. Okay. Hello, child. Hello, child. Shall we continue your lessons? It's a hard to find decent folk nowadays. Ah, oh, yes, I'm back within the hallowed halls of Candlekeep. With this iron crisis upon us, the trip to Barrow Ghost was more hazardous than I care to relate. <clears throat> You're Grind's ward, aren't you? My, you have come your, uh, into your own. If you'd permit an old man jealous of youth to say so, I left an identify scroll with Tetheril in the inner grounds. He should be done examining it by now. If you can fetch it for me, I'd be grateful. Okay. My hotel's as clean as an elven arse. Hello there, young one. Come to visit your old pal Winthrop. Here he and don't forget the 10,000 gold piece entrance fee as per Candlekeep custom, don't you know? It's outrageous. What kind of fool do you take me for? Stuff your inn and stuff your company. You're always the big kidder, Winthrop. That gets funnier nearly every time I hear it. Well, perhaps not quite so often. It's having a bit of fun with you, with you, my friend. The monks may be walking around with poles in their nethers, but you know you're always welcome here in my sight. Ryan did well by you. He did. Is there anything I can do for you? Some drinks, a room to sleep, anything to buy? We have. Okay, now we go to here. All right, so what do I have? Do I have, I have nothing right now. So we're going to get a longbow. Do I have to buy arrows? I do. Uh, probably want like what? I, how many arrows do you think I should buy? Uh, Larry Lawless, thanks for the 73, buddy. 300? 240? Oh god. Buy like 100. About 350? Um, I should probably buy some armor. My helmet. I wear a helmet. Oh. Okay. Okay. Look up in that. Quiver those. Okay. Great. Get that dagger. No time to chit chat. 
Uh, step up to the heat, young one. You'll need a good fire to warm the chill stairs of those monks. <laughs> most inhospitable they are. Isn't that so, lovey? Oh, yes, darling. The most standoffish. Uh, they lead a somewhat cloistered life here, so they are unaccustomed to many visitors. You are perhaps a bit colorful compared to what they're used to. Colorful, dear. Perhaps we should dress a little more plainly to fit in. Mm, it's worth a try, my dear. Although our clothes may be half of it, they certainly couldn't react any worse than they have. <laughs> I thank you for the suggestion, Co. and putting it tactfully. Good eve to you. Oh, they sound like dicks. Ooh. Ooh. I'm significantly... You have but to ask. I'm gonna steal this man's money. I'm significantly regretting my life decisions of not having lockpicking right now. Oh, I want to steal from everyone. Don't touch me. I might catch something. Uh, my apologies. I've been knee deep in tomes all day. I'm quite in quite a fog as a result. Oh, indeed, such a wondrous depository it is. I have returned on many an occasion, much to my banker's dismay, and have not yet scratched the surface of the collection here. Would it be, would that it were so for all of my noble brethren? I fear many come to the keep merely to proclaim that they did. I suppose it makes them appear more intelligent, though simply quizzing places the majority of them securely about the chimp level. Simply quizzing places the majority of them securely about the chimp level. I'm sorry, Tinder Ramble. Good eve to you. Is that a Diablo rifle? The cow level? Wow. Make sure you have more than one weapon. Weapons break in this game because of bad ore from the mine. Just an FYI. Oh, I completely forgot. Thank you. Away with you, beggar. <laughs> but I certainly hope there's an explanation for this intrusion. Explain yourself. My apologies. I must have gotten the room numbers mixed about. Dreadfully sorry. Dude, these voice acting, the voice acting in this game is amazing. Okay, let's go. Oh, bows don't break. Okay, cool. You have but to ask. It shall be as you wish. All right, we got to find Gorion. Gor is it Gorion or Gorion? Probably, I think Gorion. Didn't he say Gorion during the intro? Oh yeah, Tri War. Yeah, man, that would be, that'd be a fun one. Maybe we use that one in BG too. Thank Hello, you, bud. Child. Shall we continue? Oh, I know about the circles. Yeah. Uh, is there a button that shows all the active, all the items that I can look at? There's quick save. There we go. Is that is that it? Maybe. Is it tab? Ah, perfect. Thank you. Hello, child. Uh, we, we know about that. Your listeners. Priest quarters. Hello. Oh, goody, goody. I've gone and found you first. You are the ward of Gorion, no doubt. I am. What can I do for you? Oh, our encounter shall be quite simple for you. Plainly put, I have made it my mission to end your life. Success will mean a little respect among my peers, so you see you can do very little except die. That, um... Ooh, pretty easy. Wait, did I just put stuff on his body? Wait. Oh, this is mine. Give me that. Yeah, I need to get lock picking immediately. Can a, rain, can a fighter get lock picking? I need to get a rogue in my party. No, they can't. Oh man, yeah, we gotta get a rogue immediately. Oh, you can bash things open with melee attacks. Uh oh. Oh, you cut yourself above the brow there. What's wrong, child? Something in your eyes tells me something is very wrong. There was a man in there. He smelled like the stables, and he tried to kill me. It was horrible. Rip yourself at the end. Go join uh, Gorian at the steps of the library. You have but to ask. 
how do I how do I attack? Force an attack. Like control click maybe? No. Eat the hand? No, it doesn't seem to be forcing the attack. This is just selecting the weapon. Ah. It does not seem that I can attack it. Maybe I need a different type of weapon? Oh, I got it? Oh. Okay. We successfully forced the lock open right there. You have but to ask. Cool. Thank you. History of Halrua. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to read all these. But I will put them on the screen, so if you're watching on YouTube or on Twitch, if you'd like to pause, you can check out the lore. Drepin. What do you need? She left one of her books in. Oh, you have it already. If you could run it over to her and then come back, I've got some plans for you. Right. Beast of Ogma. These walls contain the world's knowledge. You have, uh, I was wondering what you had to offer this Temple of Wisdom. Oh. Wow, I forgot how cool that map feature is. Look at that. It's actually really slick. Yeah, is is my difficulty right? Can I change the difficulty mid game? Here it is. All hit point rolls are maximum. Party members cannot permanently die. All spells are learned automatically, and opponents do three quarters damage against the party. Let's do core rules. I feel like core rules is actually normal. Yeah, let's do core rules. And then maybe we'll, we'll see how that goes. Normal is not normal. Normal's like uh, an easier move. Buy Moradin's hammer. I thought I see to clean the rats out of this building yesterday already. Hop to it, get in there. Wait, what are the cat why are the cats in here? I shall attend to it in a trunks. Let's give them a right thrashing. Cats are useless. Dude, this combat music's amazing. All right. <clears throat> a glorious battle unlike any this world has ever seen. Here's five gold. Don't spend it all in one place. <laughs> wow. I shall attend to it in a trot. Ring. Those cats are actually the worst. I love them. In class we we are a I fighter ranger. A or a fighter bow user. We have, we have really, really good strength though, so if we if we want, we could proficiency into like some melee weapons down the road. We we've got a lot of versatility with our stats. <sighs> Hey kid, I woke late this morning and left my sword in the barracks before going on duty. If you want to get it for me, it's in the chest at the foot of my bed on the right side of the barracks. Okay, you can also find an antidote there. I think Drepin needs one for old Mesa. Our rules are very strict. Brayden asked me to teach you a bit about the finer arts of mass combat. Okay. All right, we got to go down there and do that. Also, our rules are very strict. Okay. 
It amassed combat practices in order. Okay. Okay, he's going to summon some illusions. How may I be able to see I shall attend to it in a trot. Um, yeah, I think this is just a tutorial, right? We're good. Bro just summoned a magic portal to take us outside when we could have, like, walked out the door behind us. You have but to ask. That's kind of intense, man. Style points, yeah. Oh, hell yeah. 15 gold. Uh, Enzovo with the three months. Never played PG1 and 2, but looking Good forward show. to this playthrough. Thank you, buddy. Trixie Moon with the five months, or with the five bomb. Thank you, Trixie. I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. <clears throat> I have a blade with your name on it. Oh, God. Ryan's little up, aren't you? Yeah, you match the description. You don't look so dangerous to me. That I am. Do I know you? I don't believe you do. I'll not be here long, so it don't matter. You'll not be here long either. Uh, oh, Dang, dude. Champions. That guy clonked me. Wow. Ancient Geezer with a $100 tip to the mod team. Thank you, bud. <sighs> BGE is a gem bag and potion case for inventory management. Good show and Merry Christmas from Ancient Geezer. Thank you and thank you for tipping the mod team. Appreciate you, man. And yeah, I'm gonna go through these arrows. It pretty shall quickly. be as you wish. <coughs> hey, Karan. Something on your mind? Wherever he was, he lunged at me with a knife. Karen, what's happening in this place? It's not this place, child. It's you thereafter. Garin was is waiting in the steps. Gorian is waiting on the steps of the Central Library and wants you to go to him as soon as you have bought what you need at the inn. Oko, I've been your tutor for so many years, and only this moment have I come to doubt that my teachings have been enough. Go to Gorian, child. It's safe for you here no longer. We're gonna sell here pretty soon. I shall attend to it in a trice. I should have joined the army. Ugh, what a mead-filled night. The hull is just too much. Poor Sap had to go man the gate this morning, too. I don't know how he does it. What can I do for you? Uh, nothing was just nosing about. I'm not going to tell him that Hull forgot his sword, because that might be his boss. I don't want to, like, get the guy in trouble. I probably shouldn't force the lock on these next to these dudes, right? Xay! I should have joined the army. Stealing within the sanctity of Candlekeep? This is blasphemy of the highest order. Up yours, you uppity bald virgin. My spleen! Let's give them a right thrashing! It shall be as you wish. It shall be as you wish. Okay, let's return this guy's sword. He was right over here. Mm. Take your sweet time, didn't you? Gorian's a fool for trying to bring you up right, and you can tell him I said so too. Wow. What a dick. Hey, maybe I should have turned him in. <coughs> Jeez. Go to safe's coming five minutes into the game. 